morning, guys. Good morning. It's like oh, a little past 5.30 in the morning. This homeless ministry. No one else we, wanted to come. We're the only ones going. We realized that we are the two most directionally challenged people on the team. And um, we don't know where this place is, so that doesn't really help with the direction. Um, and apparently we'll just see people and we'll know. So, uh, see any people. <laughs> I mean, the fact that we have like grit in our eye probably doesn't help with the seeing the people. <laughs> we are 100% completely lost. Well, not that we're lost, we just don't really get where this is. So it's like, by the Radisson, we're by the Radisson, by the bridge, we're by, by the, the bridge. bridge. On the bridge. I'm about to give up. It's really windy and dust keeps blowing in my eyes and my mouth. Um, <laughs> change of plans. Sometimes when you get lost, the only best thing to do is to uh, duck into a coffee shop. I mean, the thing is, I was so excited to do this thing as well because yeah. it sounded so fun, and the guy's story sounded really interesting. He had been like, oh, "Where did he come from?" Iran, and he yeah, he came from Iran, and then he moved here or something. Yes, he died. Oh yeah, he died, and then he had like a uh, like out of body. Jesus like met him yeah. and like brought him back All to life. All this stuff, and then he was homeless for a while, and then he started running this homeless ministry. Let's just compare, shall we? Mine's um, a flat white. Mine's clearly the American Joseph's coffee. Latte. I've been here before, three years ago. Shout out to Espresso House. <laughs> keeping good, it real. It's good coffee. We had a really good time. Mm -hmm. About like future things and plans and stuff that might be in the making. And just life and like God and the guy we could this. Yeah, we're pretty much doing the same stuff that we did yesterday, which is exciting because I really enjoyed it. So. Today we thought it would be warmer. I mean, I knew it was going to rain. But I, it was I mean, I'm wearing my flip gloves and it's so windy. I said, like, I saw a chair go, go like three blocks. It's like just after you said that, I saw this girl like walking past with that. Yeah. We're just waiting for the rest of the team to get here. Also, I'm growing quite accustomed to this church. It's so big. It is very cold today. It got so much colder since we like have been in the church, and it's raining and I'm freezing and it's windy. And we're here at the outside the church with the thread line. As you can see, it really is cold. Yesterday I was burning to death. Yeah. Because of the sun. So now we're freezing. We're <laughs> sure <laughs> <laughs> one, one advice that we have uh, started with. Is to go there and bring coffee or tea. Yeah. Sandwiches that have taken lots of time of developing a confidence in each other. Yeah, it's yeah. not made day in a day. Right. We never uh, question and, and interview the girls, why are you here? We don't judge them. We don't judge them. Yeah. Hi. Thanks for making this. What you just saw was um, a woman who came in to talk to us about her testimony um, of being a prostitute here and then her current work in the red light district here in Stockholm. Callie. Callie and her iced coffee. Reunited with her love at last. You know, I can't do this eyebrow. I can only do one too. You can only do that one. Same. What do you got? I can't do either. Like, this one doesn't go. Alright, so we're heading to the square. And we're meeting everyone here from the church. We can sing from 2 o'clock. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Only 20 minutes you can. Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. By the minute it's warming up, Jesus changes the weather for you. Okay. <laughs> this would be like the ear. 
Okay, and then make another one. Oh, nice refreshing pizza. Yeah, you're <laughs> it's a sword, I've made it. Oh, good job, honey. Jane, you just love what's going on right now. I don't know. It's in my sword. We don't know. Probably, though. That's cool. There's like a clown over there. And he's trying to like basically take our balloons and then like sell them or something like for like he made them. I don't really get it. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, very nice. That looks good. Yeah, and then you so were just, just like photography. everyone was doing. Yeah, and Brie and Dan were doing photography as well and journaling. Yeah. So that's so cool. Yeah, he like knows what we like and he mm -hmm. works with that. Yeah, exactly. Tomorrow we're going to be working at the um, refugee, refugee camp, teaching Swedish, or we're not teaching Swedish, but going to the Swedish class, and um, we have the afternoon off, I believe. So we're going to have a little bit of team time as well tomorrow. Um, and right now we're actually getting ready to go shoot the last scene, I don't know what to call it, clip, for our um, channel trailer. So that should be up tomorrow. maybe tomorrow. Obviously it's up now already, but you guys have seen it. Um, so it'll, it should be up soon though. Um, QTC soon, a little bit of makeup for that. But. Until then guys. Oh, what?